A sinkhole is an area of ground that has no natural external surface drainage when it rains. The water stays inside the sinkhole and typically drains into the subsurface. Sinkholes can vary from a few feet to hundreds of acres and from less than one to more than 100 feet deep. Some are shaped like shallow bowls or saucers whereas others have vertical walls. Some hold water and form natural ponds. Typically, sinkholes form so slowly that little change is noticeable. But they can form suddenly when a collapse occurs. Such a collapse can have a dramatic effect if it occurs in an urban setting. Sinkholes are common where the rock below the land surface is limestone, carbonate rock, salt beds, or rocks that can naturally be dissolved by groundwater circulating through them. As the rock dissolves, spaces and caverns develop underground. Sinkholes are dramatic because the land usually stays intact for a while until the underground. Spaces just get too big. If there is not enough support for the land above the spaces, then a sudden collapse of the land surface can occur. Dissolution of the limestone or dolomite is most intensive where the water first contacts the rock surface. Aggressive dissolution also occurs where flow is focused in pre-existing openings in the rock, such as along joints, fractures, and bedding planes, and in the zone of water table fluctuation where groundwater is in contact with the atmosphere. Rainfall and surface water percolate through joints in the limestone. Dissolved carbonate rock is carried away from the surface and a small depression gradually forms on exposed carbonate surfaces. A depression may focus surface drainage, accelerating the dissolution process. Debris carried into the developing sinkhole may plug the outflow, ponding water and creating wetlands. Gently rolling hills and shallow depressions caused by solution sinkholes are common topographic features throughout much of Florida. Both natural and human-caused sinkholes can pose a great risk to local communities. When sinkholes occur in urban areas, they can result in the partial and complete collapse of over ground structures and damages to infrastructure, cause high economic losses, evacuation and displacement of residents and can in some rare cases lead to the loss of lives. When sinkholes occur in nature their impact is more limited to changes in the regional topography, change to local fauna and flora and change the course of subsurface waterway.
go well in Kerala, India sinks a couple feet into the ground. And subsequently disappears completely. Oh, Zemazem Kayan, bruh.